All right, we got winner's quarterfinals. Katana, newcomer, uh, been playing kind of nice lately, I'm not going to lie. Make his way to winner's quarterfinals versus Yama. Um, Yama the homie. And we got a Ness Fox matchup. This is yeah. a really interesting one. I mean, Ness is one of those characters that's kind of not being used a lot in the metagame, but his frame Ooh. data is just so good that I, I, it's always stunning to, to see people just say that he's a bad character. Oh, but and then he gets edge guarded at 7% by like any of the top teams. Yeah, it, it's pretty wild. It's a hard it's a hard life for Ness, but he, he can make it work. Ooh. For sure. I think we got two characters that have really powerful advantageous states and really weak disadvantageous states. Fox, I would agree. Yep. If, if anybody puts their hands on Fox, that man is pencil him in for 70 free damage. We got a one minute button check or what, what what's up with this? You ain't Mewtwo King. Come on now. There we go. All right, button check over into the actual game. Let's see if we're going to be starting off in Final Destination here. Straight to Battlefield, Fox's favorite stage. We let that one through. Not sure about that pick. Ness does benefit from having people above him thanks to that strong up air, but Fox is kind of the king of this stage. Starting off instantly with a... Up throw that doesn't make anything out of. So I, I just want to comment on something real quick. Katan 2 would air left to get here. Okay, I guess that man is very nice. Yeah. Then. And he's already starting to put in work. He's. I mean, he's reacting right now. Like, that means Yama is a very good player, and Katana just making him look slow. And yeah. That, that's kind of a lot of the Fox players can do that. A lot of the Fox players love hitting buttons, and it seems like Katana is no exception here. And this is, that's so crazy, too. It's like, this isn't even a player that I've heard of even remotely anywhere else. Him, yeah. It was him, Cube, and uh, Jarv that all came in together. Exactly, and we have Cube and Katana. In winner's in quarters, quarters, smoking Katana stuff. starting off with a commanding one stock lead here. 25%, that's nothing. Yama is kind of, I think he feels lost. He's, he's, he's really trying to hit buttons, but they're not doing much. Yeah. Whenever Fox gets him into that vortex, like, throw situations or gets him above him, he just doesn't have an answer to get down. Ooh. Ooh. I'm jabbing through the PK fire. Yeah, that it is not going to work against a fast faller at low percent. Dash attack crosses up, and you can't get anything out of it. Did he just read that down dodge? This man is smart as well as fast. Just go off stage with the shine spike. Oh. Do it. <laughs> PK Thunder Trap, but no. Nope. Fox is great. Air mobility is able to get out of that. Great back air, but, I mean, it's really going to be the catch. He, did, he took his jump, so all right. Yeah, Fox recovery is a little bit too good for that. Yeah, I don't think you can really go off stage. That might kill. Yeah, that's not going to kill. He was too far away from the Rage, blast. Though. Oh, there's nice. two. All yep. right. Three, three. three. Yep. Hit him against the PK flash. Okay. That's going to kill. Nice Goodbye. Yeah, no Yeet. stage in the world is going to help you there. Once you're at like 60%, you're playing the do not get grabbed game against Ness. So are we going to see like a ridiculous PK Thunder 2 kill, or are we just going to watch Katana wipe it up? I mean, Katan is definitely going in there, so he's going to make himself vulnerable to some of the Ness's stupid shenanigans, but yeah. he definitely doesn't seem to be the type of box that's going to camp it out, but he doesn't need to. I like that. Baited the air dive by jumping on the plat, make him think he was going for the up air, maybe the raw back air, and then just wait. Ooh. Bow! Up smash. Yeah, Fox is definitely, like, I mean, you see it in other fighting games, but not so much to smash Vortex characters. Fox oh, is yeah. It is 50-50 oh, every time that man puts his hand on Fox you. is so oppressive. Yeah, if you hit buttons against Fox, you're going to have a bad time. Just yeah. sit and shield and pray. Totally agree. We're going to see Yama make the switch uh, to also Fox. Uh, no? Mm -hmm. uh, Pikachu? I don't know what he's doing. Pikachu is a really good counter pick, to be honest. If he's got a good Pikachu, I'd, I'd recommend it. Yeah, I would too. Have, have you ever been edge guarded before as against Pikachu? Well, let's do it with a character that just has nothing to respond. <laughs> like, Pikachu just destroys Fox on stage. It's stupid. No, we're going to Old Faithful Cloud. I, I don't know, man. When in doubt, pick a top tier. I'd be surprised. I was going to say, I would imagine if he was going to switch, he'd go Lucas. Okay. Ooh, but we see the character outfit swap. Rider now die. he's going Bumblebee Ness, which is a lot better. The color counter pick is the best counter pick. Yes, it is. Absolutely. I go to the American Mario set game three every single time. <laughs> like, listen, I ain't just fighting for myself. You gotta do it for the country. We're on Town and City. Again, a stage that Fox benefits from, but Ness's kill throws are just gonna be so much more potent here. 
we're kind of seeing that Ness has good frame data and he's able to get out of Fox's combos, but the problem is that Fox has better frame data. So those that up air, that neutral air that Ness is usually able to use for against mediocre characters to get out of their not true combos, it's not working out so great. Air dodge and uh, that back air. I can't help but think it's a bit of a condition laying down. Ooh, that was a mistake. It's a bit of a tech club by both players running off the stage instead of punishing. And now we're back into footsie. Just who has better buttons? The answer is always Fox and Cloud. Down throw. Let's see if we can get some of those fastballer combos. Unfortunately, not so much. Air dodge back on stage, unpunished by Katana. That time we got it with the up air. PK Fo Thunder Trap, but not again. Katana's actually starting to really play a little bit more defensively here. You see him pulling out the gun every now and then. I mean, he's definitely putting on pressure, but he's more willing to just not run off stage like a madman or run at this man all of a sudden crazily. Forward tilt into another combo. What's not going to be able to end it. Professor Guppy filling in for Vanilla since he had to go handle some internal affairs. Could not get the jump cancel in to finish up that stock. Welcome, Guppy. You're in the Ooh. middle of a good one as our newbie, Katan, is really just in a tight one with Yama. Game one was kind of an easy one for Katan, two stock, but... It'll be tricky for him to get back. This time, there's definitely been an adjustment. That color counter is working out spades. You see that untouchable spin? Sacrifice yeah. nothing. Go thank, for it, thank baby. Thank you, Sakurai. Oh, and the up air instant Woo. return. Gotta give that respect. That noggin is needy. Four air, can't get the follow up though. It's actually Fox looking at him, uh, even game. Yeah, after that really bad game one, I was kind of expecting Katan to, to run a train right here, but he, Yama has made some great adjustments. Props to him here. Mm. He's making this not just competitive, but he's poised to take it. If he just needs only 40 more percent, and then Katan's a kill yeah. percent. Very, very careful. Ooh, watch it. Yeah, there's no punish there. Nope. PK Fire is a little bit too slow to punish that really swift frame data Fox. Great dash attack. Good catch in the tail end. All right. Again, we're seeing another up tilt up air. He's got to be uh, really on point with these, even if he is there. Ooh. Great catch, no up air to finish it up. Katan really smartly jumps away. Both of them got to be very careful because. Okay. It's like this is a scary spot for both players right now. PK Thunder catch again onto the onto the taxi platform. Oh, the just run up and up smash him. All right, but like we all wanted to see that PK Thunder two happen, right? Oh yes. <laughs> So Still though, Katan coming in close with the 2-0. Yeah, I gotta say, I'm really impressed with Yama buckling down after he, he definitely lost confidence game one in his nest, and then he went back to the character. Yeah. And every time you see people that have secondaries looking and deciding, ah, I just go to the secondary, he definitely went ahead and just said, I'm gonna do this work. And props to him, he did. That was a very close game too. Good stuff to Katan. We're gonna see Act Two and Dinner Pants up next. Oh boy.